NetDialogues NetX monitors and analyzes your WAN performance and applications based on information received from various device types in your network. In this example, we use two data sources from the routers, NetFlow information, which helps you to classify the applications, and QoS information, which helps you to match application priorities with network information. NetX presents the information in a logical way, in a unified dashboard, so you can easily gain insight into the applications and the performance of the network. Let's take a look at the site of Madrid in the navigation tree. The details page shows which applications are running on the network. It also indicates a peak in traffic, indicating high utilization of the network. You can match that peak with the QoS information and see that the quality of service is classified as critical. By opening the user page, you can see which user has been responsible for this traffic. In this case, the high peak was caused by one of the IP addresses. The page also shows to which IP address the traffic was sent. The DSCP values on the user page can be compared with the QoS traffic during this day period. All information in NetX is stored on a per-minute basis and is aggregated on the fly into any desired time period, from 15 minutes to a month. The Trends page shows trend information on utilization and network efficiency. Trends can also be viewed in the overview tables, the remote site, round trip time, WAN volume and utilization columns, all give an indication of trends. Apart from looking at traffic from a site perspective, you can look at traffic from an application perspective. You can instantly see which sites generated the application traffic and how much traffic they generated. The navigation tree used for sites is also available for applications. By clicking, for instance, on Moscow, you can see the amount of traffic generated in Moscow as well as the various destinations of the traffic. NetX provides user information on all levels. For each location, information received from the network is projected to the local time zone. NetX enables you to distinguish between business and non-business hours for each location. Let's take Salesforce as an example. During all hours, there has become a period of high utilization. When zooming in on business hours, it becomes clear that utilization has been much more profound during working hours. So, there is indeed a utilization problem during business hours, definitely impacting the active users involved. When you look at the service levels, you will see two types of alerts. Network capacity alerts and application-specific alerts. After selecting, for instance, the Office SLAs, the application shows that a problem has been identified at one location. You can zoom in on that location to see what type of service level objective caused the problem and which type of application was involved. So it is immediately clear what the problem is. NetX shows the impact of a problem on business processes. Here, you see that marketing uses the Office application and that the problem identified earlier at Heppenheim is indeed impacting the performance of the users in the business process of marketing. Reports can be generated on demand or can be scheduled for convenience. NetX offers report templates that allow you to insert any of the available graphs into a report. NetX also has analytical components. They help you gain more in-depth information. NetDialog, Networked Application Visibility.